right, let's get started, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, welcome. All right, so let's address this very crucial topic. And I learned all of this from one of the people that I look up to a whole lot, Ed Milet. And he talked this morning about chasing your dreams. All right, I watched uh, uh, his post and he emphasized a lot about what is going to happen when you set out on this journey, when you set out on this goal, on this thing you want to achieve, right? And he talked a whole lot about what it takes to win, of course. So chasing your dream, of course, is never easy. That you and I already know that, all right? There is obviously, you know, the stumbling blocks, there is doubts, and, you know, after you've invested all this incredible amount of time and effort, you know, along the way, along this journey, you know, you can get to a point where you can start, you know, rethinking yourself. So why do people actually go through this? Why do people continue dreaming? Why do people continue hoping that this thing they're doing or this goal they're about to achieve is gonna work at some point? You know, why do people chase this crazy dream or this some some sort somewhat impossible thing that they want to achieve? It's simple. It's very simple that as someone who has or who is in pursuit of his dreams and I've watched a lot of people and I still watch a lot of people that are chasing their dreams every single day. You know, the likes of Ed Milet, like I mentioned earlier, my own personal mentor, Lillian Apono, Daniel Fumbo, Arnold Kobe. These are just a few people that I know personally and that I see them going after their dream, grinding every single day. I can guarantee you that the end result is a million times better than you can ever imagine. The sweat and sacrifice that you're putting in right now is worth it. It's going to be worth it. So I want you to stick with it, all right? You will be rewarded, of course, 100% in a way that you could never otherwise imagine. You will change your life and you will change your family's life and your next generations to come if you stick to it. As high a price as it is, you know, to chase your dreams, there is even a higher price to pay if you don't dream, if you don't go after it. The price of regret, I can tell you this, is um, enormous. The price of regret out by a huge margin outweighs the price for chasing your dreams. When you chase your dreams, guess what? You give yourself a shot at your dream life. But when you sit on the sidelines and just watch and complain and whine and see everything negative going on, I can guarantee you, you won't be happy where you end up. That is a guarantee. So we're gonna leave this call tonight with a commitment. Chase your dreams. Never give up. Believe that you're going to do it. Believe that you are worth it and believe that you are the right person for the job. All right. Thank you so much. Let's hear from other people.